Well, I've been at it. I've been training for at least three months, I think it was. And it's good to be back. I mean, it's very difficult at the beginning. Right there. Yeah. In this Las Vegas training session. Now, you've got a new trainer. Does that mean that there's a whole new training system for you? Well, not basically. I mean, the trainer basically puts me in condition. And I have another, my, my dear friend, Jane Bright, who grew up with me and trained up in the Catskills. And he's going through the same drills with me that Cus went through. And we come along very well. It's facts, I'm the best, you know what I mean? I sometimes, I don't want to believe in myself, but it's the truth, I'm the best. I know I'm the best fighter in the world and I proved it time and time again.
This is the main event of the evening. 12 rounds of boxing for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing, in the blue corner, fighting out of London, England, weighing in at 228 pounds, or 16 stone, four pounds, with a professional record of 32 wins, two defeats, with 31 KOs. Ladies and gentlemen, he is rated number world in the world by the WBC. He is the challenger, Frank Bruno. And in the red corner, from Catskill, New York, weighing 15 stone, eight pounds, or 218 pounds, he is undefeated in his professional career, 35 wins, 31 KOs. He is the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. Instructions in the dress room. I'm cautioning you again. Obey my commands at all times. Is there any questions? Shake hands. Good luck. Bruno showing that he's not afraid. Hanging on. Bruno's already tagged with the right hand. And there goes Bruno for the first time tonight. Watch this now and let's see just how it happened. There was a short right hand that caught Bruno. He was wobbled. And then another right hand kind of up over the shoulder. Caught him off balance. And you notice Tyson never stopped swinging. This is a short right that has him in trouble. Right now he's he's wobbled on his legs. And then it's up in the top of the back of the head. But he's not hurt here at all. And then of course Richard Steele moves in. Bruno's clear, but he knows the power of Mike Tyson. Mike is just looking for an opportunity to cut loose. And Richard Steele warns Frank Bruno about hanging on and hitting Mike Tyson bowl. It's Mike Tyson. Bruno has all the pride of England standing for him. He get tagged again by a right hand. He misses Frank Bruno. Bruno has come to try and mix it up. He's hanging on. Tyson hit with a light left hand. Does it by catching him in the first round. He's nailed again with that inside right hand. In such magnificent shape. Big vicious body shot. The right hand catches Bruno. Left hook. Bruno looks ready to go. Now is what he's going to hang on. And he does. He has the ring sense and wherewithal. Bruno is going to stop pouring with that left hand and get a punch off. Mike catches him with a good left hook in a way with the other hand. Tyson, Tyson just really pours in like a madman almost. Bruno comes back and he catches Tyson. Vicious body shot. That light, oh, another right hand gets through. Come on, punch it, get out. Tyson, on the other hand, one round his last. This place seats about eight or nine thousand here at the Hilton Hotel. Bruno was caught that time, and Tyson knows it. Tyson trying to attack now to finish him off. Bruno has the wherewithal with the uppercut. Lancer, big right hand. Bruno's in big trouble now. He's ready to go. Uppercut comes that time. A fighter cannot be saved by the bell as the big right hand lands. Tyson knows he's got him in big trouble. If he doesn't answer it. This was the final combination. Right to the body, right uppercut. Teed him up the left hand, then another right uppercut, followed by a big left hook to the head. Mike Tyson. Chance for a nice close-up view here. Beautiful right to the body there, right up a gut to the chin. What kept Bruno's mouthpiece in, I'll never know. And he was all at sea at this stage, and Terry Lawless was up on the ringside apron there, waving the towel as referee Steele stepped between them. Richard Steele has moved in and has stopped the fight. Michael Tyson wins on a fifth round. TKO.
There's nobody that can beat me. Nobody that can beat me. for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the white trunks with red trim. He weighs an even 218 pounds from Otsika, New Jersey. His professional record, 22 victories against only two defeats, 17 knockouts to his credit, and 14 of those 17 KOs within five rounds or less. Ladies and gentlemen, the number one heavyweight challenger in the world today, Carl. The Truth, Williams! And his opponent fighting out of the red corner, wearing the solid black trunks and weighing in at 219 and one quarter pounds from Catskill, New York. His professional record is unblemished with 36 consecutive victories, 32 knockouts, 28 KOs in five rounds or less, and 16 in the first round alone. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the undisputed, the undefeated, heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Fight Tyson! The people in William's corner are sincerely worried about... This is so, somewhat of a reunion here because both men have just thrown punches. Because Wynn's left jab is so strong, that should help him as long as he keeps that right hand up. The reason people fear Mike Tyson is because he's one of the few, if not the only man, that can knock you out in the heavyweight division with one punch. At the devastating left hook. And what Tyson does here, he wee bobs and wees, gets under that jab and counters with a beautiful left hook. Uh, can we assume that Michael Dokes is one of the prospects? All Come one, come all, because nobody can get close to me. They're not even close. I'm the best fighter in the world.